All right, okay. which two had the heart valve issues? This one, Jean, and this one, Gloria. 80-year-old Gina Naser has more in common with her sisters than she'd like, a leaky or bad heart valve. It's a problem she also shares with her 57-year-old son, Jeff. I fainted and everybody insisted I go to the doctor, so I went to the doctor. He sent me for a stress test and everything, and he said, well, you've got a leaky valve. And for Gina, it meant replacement surgery of her mitral valve. For Jeff, it was repair surgery for a similar issue. They said I had it all my life. It just got progressively worse. Uh, and when I went to see Dr. Etosh, he, he said that, you know, it was something I needed to get done, so. And that meant surgery for Jeff as well. Both mother and son benefited from a new procedure that required less time in the hospital. Uh, minimally invasive uh, valve surgery, basically. Dr. Stephen Etosh says new technology is allowing him and other heart care specialists around the nation to use smaller incisions to repair bad or leaky valves, which don't open and close properly. Instead of a long incision through the sternum or breastbone, Dr. Etosh can now use longer surgical instruments to get to the valves through much smaller incisions. What are the benefits, Dr. Etosh, of this new procedure versus the old or standard way? Uh, for several reasons. Number one, and the most obvious, is just cosmetic reasons, obviously. It's a smaller incision, so it's less traumatic, and so the recovery time is usually generally less. Instead of six to eight weeks of recovery time, perhaps only four weeks. Dr. Etosh performs the mix or minimally invasive cardiac surgeries here at Norton Audubon Hospital and at Norton Hospital downtown. Medtronics, which makes the equipment that Dr. Etosh uses, says Dr. Etosh is the first surgeon in the Louisville area to perform the procedure. And the mitral valve should close completely and not allow blood to flow in the wrong direction. Dr. Etosh says minimally invasive surgery is a good option when there is a specific issue with only one of the four heart valves and with no other complicating factors. And that was good news for Gina and Jeff, who hope others in their large family escape the heart valve issue that's affected so many of them in the past. I know people who have had the surgery the old way and it took them a long time and they had the scar. So it was, I'm glad we got it done. No complaint. Great. Recommend it to anybody. <laughs> For Norton Healthcare's Get Healthy, I'm Jackie Hayes.